In our morning round, an unusual idea to keep babies safe is spreading in the United States. Parents are investing in boxes that serve as cardboard cribs for infants. Doctors say the simple design could lower infant mortality. Tony DeCoppel is at Cooper University Hospital in Camden, New Jersey, with the origins of this growing movement. Tony, good morning. Hey, good morning. You know, every year about 3,500 babies die in sleep-related accidents, often because they can't breathe. Now, the state of New Jersey thinks it has a solution, a way to lower that number using this, a cardboard box that doubles as a crib. With cheering crowds in Camden, New Jersey, Dolores Peterson became one of the first people in the state to pick up a free box for her baby. She was just like chilling in there, looking everywhere. Oh, geez, so good. I thought she'd scream, but she didn't. She liked it. She admits it felt a little strange putting five week old Arabella in a crib made of cardboard, but inside is a firm mattress, a fitted sheet. She looks comfortable and the kind of clean, uncluttered environment that doctors recommend for safe sleep. The box ain't nothing special, but there's somewhere for her to sleep where she won't get SIDS or get hurt. Because uh, you can have her in your bed and just roll over and that's it. SIDS is sudden infant death syndrome, a major reason why the United States is way behind other countries in infant mortality, ranking 26 in the most recent study. At the top of that list is Finland, a country that's been giving out baby boxes for nearly 80 years. I would love to take credit for coming up with the idea, but actually I read the same article that millions of people did around the world called Why to Finish Babies Sleep in Boxes. Jennifer Clary is co-founder of the Baby Box Company, launched in Los Angeles in 2013. She sells the basic box online for about $70. You know, a box can be anything. The reason that ours are valuable is because not one parent receives one of my baby boxes without having received copious safe sleep education. With money from the CDC and corporate donors, more than a million mothers nationwide will have access to a baby box this year, Clary says. That includes pilot programs in San Francisco and a hospital in New Hampshire. We have these new baby boxes that we're going to be sending you home with. Are you ready to go now? But New Jersey's effort is by far the most ambitious, providing every mother a box plus supplies worth about $150. Catherine McCanns is chair of the New Jersey Child Fatality and Near Fatality Review Board, which runs the program. We have to change everyone's behavior so that no child is left at risk. And it's really not about your socioeconomic status. It's about what is the safest environment for your baby. Oh, Thanks to her baby box, Dolores Peterson is already resting easier. I mean, I was like, what, what's so great about this box? But when you stop and think about what it's really good for, I wanted a box. And babies can sleep in these boxes for about six months. To get one, parents have to go online, watch a 10 to 15 minute series of videos and take a short quiz. And in just the first day of the program, about 3,800 parents did so. Gail? Well, Joni, that young mother who said that box ain't nothing special, what makes it, what makes it so great? Because it's so small? It is clean and uncluttered, and the babies have nothing that can block their flow of oxygen, which is the number one reason why babies under the age of one die in the United States. Okay. Where are you supposed to put the box? On you the can floor? put the box on any hard surface, and even if the baby rolls, the box won't roll off. So if you're cooking, if you want to take a shower, you have a moment to yourself, any number of things that mothers have to do to get through the day, the box is a solution. Babies aren't rolling off beds. Babies aren't having any of the risks that they would have in the absence of something safe and secure like this. Tony DeCoppel, we got to go. But before we go, congratulations to you. I heard you got engaged over the weekend. Woo! -hoo. That's great. I did. Got great up news. early this morning, though. Thank you very much. <laughs> All right. All right.